I just think that we got into this so fast that we didn't have time to grow. The thing is, I don't want to limit you. You're an amazing girl. So, what does this mean? Right now, I want you to feel free. Nice line. You're the player everyone says you are. Don't do me any favors. So, did you do it? Yeah, I think she took it well. <laughs> so I guess now we're official? Who knew a week ago we'd be in love today? <laughs> we'd be what? <laughs> I just wanted to see what you'd say. <laughs> well, hey. No goodbye kiss? <laughs> so much for love. School St. Clair kicks in at 8.01. I'm super behind already. It'll be worth it. Trust me. Almost. Holly J, last minute announcement. Holly J, uh, you called about a babysitting job? Holly J, video blog interview. <laughs> There's plenty of me to go around. Whatever it takes, I know I can make it through. If I hold out, I know I can make it through. Be the best, the best that I can. better spell. What are you talking about? Mm, rumor has that you and Declan Coyne are the thing. <laughs> Not that it's a big deal or anything. It's a huge deal. He's the hottest guy in school, and you're, you, there better be a good end to that sentence on you. Attention, women leaders of the future. The Business Mentorship Award finalists are, Sasha, Amy, Holly J. And Emily. Good luck with your interviews, guys. A mentorship on top of your job and business and being president. How are you gonna have time to date? Behind every powerful woman is a man who better be cool with it. Megan Fox and Transformers. Yeah. All the special effects were CGI, except the one when she's in short shorts. I love those short shorts. Are there more pictures? Yeah. Connor, hand it over. This material's not appropriate for class. Detention. No, 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 it's just... Do you want to join your friend? No, it's just he has basketball practice. Connor should have thought of that. Bro. What are you doing? Nobody's gonna miss me at practice. Hey. You busy right now? Uh, well, I have six things to do before the bell rings in three minutes, so... Hey, you two. What's going on? Just trying to convince Law President to skip class. Oh, he can't wait till lunch. Yeah, no dice. I have math to hand in. Can you hand this in for us? Thanks, Anya. Holly J, I have the babysitting money, but what's 20% of $26? <laughs> um, Jane, can you handle this? Declan and I have an important meeting. For sure. Enjoy your meeting. Skipping school to hang out at work. What's wrong with kids today? Yeah, uh, put it on my tab. You got it, Chief. <laughs> Spontaneous meetings are fun. See, I bring unpredictable romance into your structured world. Hey, I'm not that structured. I mean, are people saying stuff about me? It's just, I used to be different. Some might say, harsh. Holly J, this is us. High school gossip doesn't matter. 
So back here after school? I can't. I have my uh, mentorship interview. Oh, that's my mother's project. She's one of the judges. Wait, what? How did you hang on to this piece of information until now? You should tell her about us. Why would I do that? Because if she has a personal stake in you and your success, she'll want to make it happen. By telling her I'm dating her son? Hello, nepotism. Uh, it's called politics. Connections make things happen. Hmm. You want to blow forth, period? Take a walk? Clear your mind before the interview? <laughs> <laughs> you look ridiculous. <laughs> yep, so do you. All that time overseas and you never developed a fashion sense? Oh, how the mighty have fallen. <laughs> okay, this one's going on for wallpaper. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys, hey. that's it. That was detention. Pretty relaxing, actually. I invented Transformers in my mind. <laughs> but you know you didn't need to take the fall. It was my magazine. It's fine. In detention, I don't have to talk to people who think I'm weird. Ah, come on, man. All right, you got to get out there, all right? Show people your true self. Get noticed. Make them laugh. Hey, guys, check it out. Connor was telling me about Pop Rocks and Root Beer Dynamite. Tell him. That's been literally disproved. Popular mechanics did a study. <laughs> not the point, man, not the point. Anyway, so what happens is you get a mouthful of Pop Rocks. It doesn't it's... work like that. <laughs> okay, dorks. Let us know when you get to the bottom of the great Pop Rocks debate. <laughs> Dave, what up? Dave. Dave. Hey, what do you want? Wondering if you're doing anything after school. Yeah, Connor, I'm going to the break room with the team. Okay, let's go. Yeah, no, 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 I don't think that's a good idea. Why not? Okay. Okay, look, all right, you were right. I shouldn't have tried to break you out of your comfort zone, all right? That was my bad. So now you're gonna avoid me? Okay, Connor, look, the guys on the team already think I'm like 49% lame And being around you might tip the balance. I thought you were my friend. Dave, hurry up. I can't tell you how impressed I am, Holly J. Or should I say, Madam President? Your classmates are very lucky to have such a leader. I'm not sure they always see it that way. They think I'm more... Type A? Driven? They tend to use other words. Mm, typical. <laughs> Young women like you are rare. A mentor can be invaluable. We'll be making our decisions soon. Well, thank you. And I'm sure I'll see you soon regardless. Your son and I are kind of dating. My son and you are... Uh... Yeah, you wanted me to make sure I mentioned it. Laura, I'm quite concerned about the optics of this situation. <sighs> Holly J, uh, this is a high-profile program we're launching. And I'm afraid it wouldn't look good to award it to my son's girlfriend. Wait, but didn't you just say I'm the best at Degrassi? Unfortunately, in situations like this, politics often get in the way. Well, I guess these are the real leadership lessons I need to learn, huh? I withdraw. Council President, it is my great pleasure to introduce Lara Coyne with a very special announcement. Thank you, Miss Sinclair. Being a business mentor means opportunity, and not just in the workplace, but a profound opportunity to meet women from different walks of life whose narratives, Roger. life experiences, and professions remind us of a woman's strength and power Roger. to overcome in a once male-dominated world. This program empowers young women to unite with each other, to connect, to lead, rather than to survive and evolve. Mind, so 
guess I gave you some bad advice, huh? Man, I'm glad I was honest. She'd have found out eventually. Sorry, I cost you the mentorship, though. And if it wasn't for so, you'd better be worth it. Wouldn't be where I am I'll do my best. And this is why our mentorship program exists. To unite young women with people like Mrs. Faraji, who teach... This could get dangerous. Women. You're my consolation prize. Within the workplace <laughs> and beyond. When I first came to Degrassi, I was honored to meet these young women. But one in particular exemplified what we were looking for. Driven, determined, and with the integrity to stand for what she believes in. Is it just me, or is it getting on here? She has outstanding grades and has fought an impressive number of work hours. A point going halfway. ...to balance school, part-time job, and volunteer with... Declan, we're gonna get in trouble. I hope so. And now, I'd like to announce the winner. Please help me celebrate Ms. Holly J. Sinclair. So, uh, after the athletics banquet, get in a hotel room with Trish. Yeah, no way. What will you and Trish do? Uh, do you want me to draw you a picture? <laughs> <laughs> Who is this guy? Bro, why do you keep following us around? Are you even on the team? Ethan, leave him alone. He's a glorified water boy. <laughs> What's your problem? I don't think I'm the one with the problem, little Dave. Yeah, you keep lipping off like that, you're gonna have one. I'm shaking. Come on, let's go. Apparently, I should have accepted your withdrawal, Miss Sinclair. It seems like right now we're in a damage control situation, so I'm... Please! My daughter was humiliated if not assaulted in front of the school. And we're talking damage control? For whom? Mom! Miss Sinclair, our family is in the public eye. And let me assure you that when those photos hit the internet, it won't look good for anyone. Okay, so I lose the mentorship. Fine. Well, you're going to punish my child for your son's actions? Absolutely not. We can't have it seem as though this affected our decision. Holly J will attend all of the sessions as planned. Congratulations. You win. But you will not see each other. Do you understand me? Cut him, Mom. So we're just supposed to be over? The less we dwell on this, the better. I couldn't agree more. I'll be right back with your photocopies. Read quietly. Hey. You want to hit up that weed today or what? I'm going to practice. Nah. I'd rather hang out with my real friends, you know? Listen, Dave, you're good. The team needs you. I think I might quit. I don't fit in and I suck. Nah, you just had a growth spirit. Your skills will catch up. This is stats. Keep them for every game. Blocks, assists, rebounds. Bro, this stuff is amazing. Makes the bench less boring. Coach has to see this. Really? Look, never mind fitting in, all right? Play to your strengths. <laughs> hey, so I guess chivalry is dead. It's not funny, Holly J. You know what's less funny? How you sat there and said nothing while they skewered me. My hands were kind of tied, okay? You saw my mother in there. Yeah, I noticed. Are you scared to make your mommy mad? In case you haven't noticed, my family's all I have, Holly J. So now what? You can't seriously believe that this is gonna get better if we split up. Look, we both know I have to move away eventually, and if we're never allowed to see each other, 
What's the point? Two bruised reps, two angry moms, one dead relationship. Awesome. At least you got the mentorship. Great, so I get to hang out with his mother and not him? Oh, it'll blow over. You've dealt with worse. How do I make people realize that this is really not a big deal? What people? Who do you actually care about in this scenario? I'm really sorry, but the Murphys don't get home till 11. I have to cancel my curfew. Call Anya. Tell her you're taking her job at the Danes. She'll hit the Murphys. They've got three docile kids. We're not losing them. <laughs> Are you really laughing at my misfortune right now? Well, I've never seen you with a problem you can't solve. Thanks for showing up. You had me up breaking into the school. It's not breaking in if you have the key. And this is the only place I could think of for us to be alone. I think we should make this work. And you wouldn't be here if you didn't think so, too. That's what I thought. Come on. This is kind of incredible. Well, it's not like we can have a romantic dinner anywhere else. <laughs> Guess the dot doesn't do lobster. <laughs> your smooth moves disappear faster by the day. I get nervous. Eat your burger. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out how something so good went so bad. It's like everything is against us. Declan, we have everything going for us. We talk, we laugh. We make each other hot. See, this is what we need to make things work. So you're saying we should just do it? Yeah, live our lives. <laughs> Or like the modern Romeo and Juliet. Sneaking around has definite appeal. No, I'm, I'm not sneaking. Well, come on, this way we get what they want and what we want. It's dramatic, it's romantic. If we can't be upfront about this, I don't, I don't want to do it at all. It's not possible. <sighs> Neither are we. Lock up. Hey, what's this all about? Everybody here? Good. Your teammates been keeping stats all season. What's in this binder is pure gold. It's gonna put us over the top. That and... Make sure Connor stays on the bench. Shut up, Ethan. Easy, Pony. Ethan, your stats are soft. Next game, you'll keep Connor company. Dave, you're starting at point guard. See you all at practice. Can't keep me off the court, dork. Hey, numbers don't lie. Nice. Just playing to my strengths. <laughs> Nicely done. Thanks. There are cameras throughout the school. Do you want to explain to your mothers what's on them? I can't believe I'm here for the second time in two days, Declan. Holly Jeanette, what did he do to you? Excuse me? What are you accusing my son of? Exactly. It's pretty obvious he's never been taught to control himself. Okay. 
We spent some time here last night working on Declan's play. That's it. Needless to say, keys are a privilege. You no longer have. Do your parents have to put you two on a leash? This is really stupid. I mean, we like each other, right? Well, Mom, you said yourself that she's the best girl in the school. I'm not disputing her talents. Well, we wouldn't have to sneak around if you didn't keep us apart. So the new plan is we're doing this. Uh, yeah, we're doing this. <laughs> you were awesome. I can't believe I just did that. Now you know how it feels. Plus their faces? <laughs> Priceless. So, uh, how are Jeanette, huh? Shut up. Are you still wandering? Make it through. And if I hold out, uh, I know I can make it through. I know, I know I can make it through.